and cheap DIY gallery art walls. That is what we're going to talk about today, busy girls. I'm Ashley Brockington with Losing with Sam and Ash, and if you are anything like me, this video is for you. If you are both very, very busy, and unfortunately don't have the time or money to decorate how you want, but then you also have crazy expectations. This is kind of the perfect place for you, the perfect solution for you and for me, because what I, how I get is I will spend tons of time researching the perfect piece of art, um, looking around and realize, I don't know if I want to spend that for just one print or you know this or that, or I'm just not quite sure. Well, I found these awesome, gallery art pads. I found this at Hobby Lobby and it's from Me and My Big Ideas which sounds like it's like a kindergarten book but let me tell you these are pretty cool and I think there are about 10 different varieties but what it is is it's an art print book and so you just you can see like that there's gold foil ones which on Etsy these would be I would say 10 to 50 dollars for a gold foil this is an 11 by 14 and there are about there are over 20 different prints in each book and they range from uh, 11 by 14 there's 8 by 10s 5 by 7s and 4 by 6s so there's a variety all of these are in this book and get this it's between 15 and 20 dollars depending on you, where you purchase it for this book so I went ahead and I got this one lots of pinks and then I also got this one called Color Me Happy that has lots of different bright colors. And so it's really, really simple. And so what we're, I'm going to be doing today is this is the wall space I'm going to decorate because I literally had someone come into my house yesterday and say, oh, so how long have you lived here? I thought, what that means is your house is not decorated. What is going on? And what's going on is that I'm really, really picky. And so I just don't make decisions and then I just kind of realized wow so I'm trying to protect my image and my taste but then because I just don't do anything and I just let things like sit around it makes it look like I have no taste so I thought you know what although these pieces might be not what I would pick out if I had an unlimited budget and unlimited time they are they're really really cool and I really really like them so I actually chose four different frames that I had from when we were photographers that I'm going to hang in. This is my dining room, and it's almost all black and white and gold. So this is the series right here that I chose. Now, it's really, really easy. All you do is you choose a print that you want, and then you cut it out. So I'm gonna use this one that I had already cut out, and so it's, it's a nice thick paper it's got this one has gold foil some of them have texture really high quality um, and then you just pop it in the frame and there you go I mean that took like no time at all and here is the craziest best thing ever I mentioned that if I were to buy these prints on Etsy that it would cost probably between 10 and 50 dollars a print um, and I said there's over 20 prints in each one of these. So if you think about, let's say, $10 a pop minimum for 20 minimum, that's at least $200 that you normally would be spending um, on these prints. But like I said, they were for $15 to $20, so that means you're spending less than a dollar per print. And you could think, oh, I could go on the computer and I could find something and print something. Well, you're not going to get gold foil out of your computer. And then also that's hours and time is money, folks. Time is money. And that's why a lot of times I don't go and decorate a lot because I would rather be working to expand my business, to make more money so that I can get those perfect pieces. But this, for me, was the perfect solution. So I'm really excited to show you how they end up. Voila! With the help of my helpful, handy husband, Sam, I now have a gallery wall. An art gallery wall with beautiful picture frames. And like I said, this is the way to go, busy girls, all right? If you want to DIY it up, I'd say go get the frames, go get old frames, go get Goodwill frames, whatever, and do that as your DIY, but just get one of these art pads for less than a dollar a print. I decorated my wall and really they're really nice even though the name is me and my big ideas which sounds like a kindergarten title 
They, there are some really nice prints in here. Like I said, texture, gold foil, there's a large variety. I got these at Hobby Lobby. You can also, I've seen them on Amazon. I'm going to put the link um, to some of the ones on Amazon below. And, and I have to say Google. Me and my big ideas, it's called a DIY um, Special Edition Gallery Art. All right, and this one I use the Isn't She Lovely and the Color Me Happy Pads. All right, busy girls, if you have great ideas on a gallery wall or decorating, I want to hear from you, especially if they save time, save money. So go ahead and put your comments below. I would love for you to share any pictures on our Facebook page at facebook.com backslash losing it with Sam and Ash. You can find this whole article with all the links on our website at losingitwithsamandash.com and follow us at Instagram. There I'm happy fit mama five. And on Pinterest, love Pinterest, I'm Ashley Brock. That's all for today, busy girls. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make a very cheap, very easy, very cool looking gallery art wall.